In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to use unlimited Claude code and GPT with the latest models. This video is for anybody. You don't need to have any technical experience. I'm going to show you guys how to do everything so you can unlimited do vibe code start to finish. On my last video, how to get free cursor, free trials unlimited. You guys watched that video up to like 90k and enjoyed it. And I saw a lot of questions and so I made this video to update you guys. And if that sounds good, I want you guys to leave a like, subscribe, and turn post notifications on. I'm going to show you guys how to use Claude code and GPT completely for free and you don't need any technical knowledge anybody can use this tutorial you can be on a windows or you can be on a mac it doesn't really matter and you can use unlimited api calls for both to do your, all of your vibe coding if you guys have any questions just comment down below i'm going to include all the links down below as well first off you're going to go to your internet browser type in google.com you're going to type in atl -A -S -I -A -N, bravo dev try then click enter scroll down you should see this link, Ravo Dev Agentic AI for Software Team. This is, is a tool that's going to show allow you to use unlimited GPT-5, Claude Code 4.5, or any of the latest models that you're currently watching right now in the current time. To show you guys that I've currently used up my Ravo Dev, you can see here in this email, the Ravo Dev is just pretty much used up. And we're going to click on Try Now. Next up, we're going to be presented with this screen. Type in any email you want. You can type in any email you want, but make sure it's a valid email because you're going to need to confirmation code one thing you can do is if you have a gmail.com email you can just start putting dots in between and it creates multiple emails for you okay so i put in my email and then i'm going to click on sign up and then after you input your email your screen open up your email take the code and then you're just going to input it when you're here you can put anything for the name and for the password you can also put anything for the password next you'll be presented over the screen you can just pick something random for this and then click on agree and start now it's gonna say we're building your site. Just wait for this to finish loading. Once you're in, it's gonna show this tutorial thing. Just click an X. Next, you're gonna scroll down. You see when it says Ravo Dev CLI, click this. From here, you're gonna open up your terminal. If you have Mac, you click on the Mac. If you have Windows, you click on Windows. If you have Linux, you click on Linux. Since I'm using a Mac right now, I'll click on Mac. Next, you'll be presented with the screen. The easiest thing to do is install it via Homebrew. And all you gotta do is click this first link, open up a brand new terminal. You can see I have a brand new terminal here. Paste it in, press enter, and then wait. You can see it's doing its thing. Okay, so there's no error codes and it ran. Next, copy the second link. Go back to your terminal, copy and paste, press enter. Don't touch anything, just let it run. And then you can see here, it shows a warning, but that's okay because I already have it installed and it's already up to date. Make sure you confirm that. You just copy ACLI space dash dash version. Go back to your terminal, control V, and you can see here, I have ACLI version 1.3.4 for yours whatever it is in your current time it's going to show you can see here that I've successfully installed Ravo Dev. now let's go back to the account screen what you're going to want to do next is click on this link don't worry if you guys forget these links or missing these links I'll include it all in the description below I click the link it's trying to generate an API key right now so I'm going back to my email and it's it's just like logging in confirming that your account is yours you can see here I got the code. Your code is just in your email. You go back here. And then after you log into the API section of the ATL Asian account for Ravo Dev, you click on create API token. Name doesn't matter. Name anything you want. Name it Kevin. Expire. You're going to be using up for the 20 million free trial credit. It takes me about six hours to use it. And you can just create this. It only takes really a few minutes to create this, right? So you just set it up ra a random date and then click on create. Wait, save this windows. It's okay if you accidentally close it. Now you're going to want to open up brand new terminal again. And then you're going to type in acli space bravo dev space off space login okay but i'm logged in right now so i'm going to log out first so you can see log out was successful i'm going to log in with a brand new account so you're going to type in acli space bravo dev space off space login if you're doing multiple times if you used up your trial make sure you log out okay so make sure like i just showed you guys before how to log out now so there's no bravo dev right now on my account logged in so i'm going to click login it's going to ask for your email your email is just the one that you signed up with before. I input my email, press enter. Next, it's gonna ask for your API token. It's the one that we just generated. You're gonna click on copy. If you click this, you can unhide it and you can hide it again. But I click copy and then paste it. Then press enter and wait. And you can see here, authentication is successful because right now you're pretty much done setting up Ravo Dev and I'm gonna show you guys how to use it. Next up, so you can see here that I've opened up a random project right now. Once you're in your directory that you wanna do vibe coding for, all you have to do is click ACLI space Robo Dev space run. Press enter and wait. Ignore the warnings. It's okay. But you can see here it's working in the directory and it's using models. So you can see I'm using the latest model of GPT-5. 
maybe if you're watching in the future, it's GPT, whatever it is in the future, or Sonnet or Cloud Code. I'm going to show you guys how to switch models. So you can see here, it's using model GPT-5. You're going to click on slash. You'll be presented with a bunch of different prompts and screens right now. You can clear your current session. You can copy the last section. You have directories. You have feedback. You have help. But what we're going for is models. So you scroll down, click models to models, click enter. And from here, if you're just signing in for the first time, you'll be um, on the auto model. So it's going to pretty much just go to Claude, the latest one. But I had it. I was using GPT-5. So, but you can switch it to any model here. So you can see here, these are the models available. I can use unlimited GPT-5. I can use unlimited Cloud Sonnet 4.5 or any of the latest models that you're on that are available. Let's switch to Cloud. And you can see I'm currently using Cloud right now. Just another one I want to show you guys. So you click slash and you go up and just a YOLO mode. It's pretty much just, if you toggle it on, it pretty much just skips all confirmations and lets it run until the task is complete instead of keep asking you for confirmations. So we, we want to see that it's working right now. Now we can type in any command. We'll just say, suggest improvements for my code base. And then you can see here it's working and it's working right now. Wow. I'm, it's pretty amazing, right? And it's vibe coding. And this is pretty much how you use unlimited cloud code, unlimited GPT five or any of the latest models and this is pretty much the best way out there to vibe code completely for free and i hope you enjoyed the video if you guys have any questions just comment it down below and i'll be happy to answer you guys this has been working for pretty much months and months and this is pretty much even better than cursor cursor vip and you can see here that this that's it for the video i hope you guys enjoyed please leave a like subscribe turn post notifications on and let me know what other videos you guys want me to make next and we can 